Hey, welcome back. This is teaser number four for what will likely be the last in the uh, four-part series of our trip down to Durham Town this past April. So this is down in Georgia, and this little track right here is just a go-fast track. Now I did say it was a go fast track and you might say, well Dave, you're not going particularly fast. And that would be true. This is the first time on this particular track and I've kind of marked it in my mind because we never actually went back to it, but it would be a good spot to kind of speed up your reaction time and all the other little processes for braking and throttling that you kind of need to get synced up so you don't hit a tree. <laughs> As I said, this was the first time on this track, so we're just trying to figure it out. And what's throwing me off is that. See that little cut to the side there? It's drainage for the road. Uh, I kept kind of thinking those were where I needed to turn, so I was slowing down to get ready to turn or anticipating turns that weren't actually turns. And uh, as a consequence, I wasn't going particularly fast. <laughs> All right, that's the excuse I'm gonna lead with, so you believe what you want. I'm gonna keep with my delusions. Generally, I don't like these kinds of trails where it's just wide double track, uh, nothing technical, no challenges. But as I said, this is like a go fast track to me, so I've kind of marked it in my mind that if we make it back, I will go here and I'll play because it's a good spot to learn how to go faster, like I said. So how does something like this teach you to go faster? Well, because it is double wide with pretty good sight lines, you're naturally going to go faster. But what you need to do is keep your head up and kind of anticipate a little bit more by looking down the trail and not looking at your front wheel and whatever obstacle might be there. So it speeds up your reaction processes, your kind of uh, decision cycle in terms of what you need to do, how you need to manipulate throttle, brake, clutch, all those inputs that allow you to shoot out of a corner or not scrub so much speed. So I think that's got a lot of use and uh, yeah, like I said, I'll come back to it. Well, that wraps up this little teaser. Stand by for part four. <laughs> 